Let's talk about how to make money with content. And let me share my screen with you so you can get started right away. Look, there are many pleasures in life and one of the best is actually making money from your posts. Imagine this, you post something and you make $5,000 because you sold something to someone who saw your post and then that client refers you to other clients and you start making even more money. That can happen even if you have fewer than a thousand followers. And today I'm going to show you exactly how to do that. But first, look, the reality is that you don't need a lot of followers to make an income with social media. And the trick is first understanding what actually works on social media and secondly, understanding that human nature rules everything. So what I'm going to be showing you today is what actually matters and two, how to use human nature to get people to buy your stuff. So let me share my screen once again with you and let's get started. First, you need to treat social media as a lead generation machine. This works even if you have a thousand followers or a hundred thousand followers. And if you post the right kind of contents, you can get people to pay you more money. And the process is super simple. You need to craft deep cut messages. And you do that first by stop posting platitudes and feel good content. Even though people are in social media to feel good about themselves and maybe stop thinking about work, that doesn't matter to you because in the end, it's all about getting paid for the time that you invest creating content. And the way to do that is by listing your clients and customers frustrations and needs. And let me give you a few examples. Let's say that you don't know what kind of content to post because you're feeling that maybe some people might judge you. Well, you can totally create a five step guide on social media on how to write with confidence or maybe show a unique strategy that you devised on how to lose fear of being judged or seven tips to write better content with confidence. You see, when you post about these frustrations and you solve these frustrations, it just makes it so much easier for people to say, hey, that's me and relate to your content. When everyone else is focused on dancing and making people feel good, you should be focusing on solving people's problems. And that's how you use human nature to create content that cuts deeply into people's psyches and, and their minds, okay? Now, the next step is write money-making threads or carousel. I would say start by posting at least one or two per week. And look, here's how I do it. I write a thread, 10 tweets, and then I turn that into carousels. So I just reuse the same content on different platforms. You can even do this on LinkedIn and it's super, super easy to do. Now, here's a little caveat. These money-making posts where you're going to show people how to solve their problems, provide a fix to their frustrations. Well, they don't actually get you a lot of engagement or retweets or <laughs> likes or shares, but they do make money. So let me show you a few tips on how to write them and how to get people to actually buy by reading your stuff. And here it goes. Look, it all starts with the hook. So you're going to write five hooks and you're going to pick the best one. And let me tell you, you do this at the end after you've written all of the 10 tweets or all of the 10 posts that you're going to be adding to your carousels. Another way you could write better threads is by hijacking the news cycle. That way, these things are top of mind. So you can hijack these ideas, present them in your own words or use them just a way to gain attention. Also, add a lot of line breaks because it just makes content so much easier to read and to scroll through and to skim through. And, and look, people don't read that much on social media. They skim. So by adding a lot of line breaks, it just makes it so much simpler for people to read. Also, add social proof. Let's say that you are a coach, a fitness coach, and you want to coach people on how to lose weight, how to get shredded. Start posting a lot of before and after photos. Now, in my case, what I do is I showcase how much money I've made my clients, how much money my students have done, and of course, how much money I usually make when I'm selling my stuff. So by adding social proof to your post, you just make it so much easier for people to believe in your enunciations, to believe in what you are doing and what you're saying. That said, make sure to keep these threads around 10 to 15 tweets because then you're going to be repurposing this on Instagram or other social media accounts and you don't want them to be like super long. 10, 15 tweets top, then you can turn them into carousels. And finally, make sure to write the first draft really fast and then over edit, meaning edit as many times as you feel comfortable and then just post that. But the trick is 
to make sure to write that first draft fast because it's usually the hardest thing you can ever do. Like for example, this video, man, it took me a while to start recording it because I was thinking like, what should I record about? And then I saw this post and I said, okay, let me record a video explaining this post to you guys. Let's go to the next phase. The next step is to shamelessly self-promote yourself because nobody else will do this for you. So there are two major ways to do this. Method A is that you're going to be posting a link to your landing page on the Twitter threads or telling people to click the link in your bio if you are on Instagram. Now, I prefer method B, which is telling people to DM you at the end of every thread or every carousel or every reel, telling them that if they're interested in your program, in your courses, in your coaching, in whatever you are doing to DM you a specific keyword. And the reason you're going to do this is because, well, you're going to be building rapport inside the direct messages and it just gives that personal touch that makes people feel heard and understood. So method B, in my opinion, is one of the best. For that reason, I'm going to be talking about it right now. Look, you want to use your direct messages to qualify people, meaning that you're going to figure out if you can actually help that person, and if you can actually help them, you can ask them about their current situation, about their goals, about where they want to be so you can find the gap between where they are and where they want to be. And that way you can discover if you can actually help them. And if you feel like you can actually help them, well, you're going to pitch a discovery call or a course or a program or send them to some resource that you've built because this is how you use content. Content is meant to create leads, to generate leads, to send people to your newsletter, to send people to your funnels. And if you're not doing this, you're missing out on monetizing social media. And you don't need a lot to make this work. You could either just start with the direct messages, which is free, or you can start a newsletter. And talking about newsletter, down below in the description, you'll find a link to download my your next $100,000 guide. It's a free guide where I show you how to start your newsletter and how to sell and how to create content that sells. It's 100% free. All you have to do is find it down below to get it right away. That's it. Thank you so much for watching this video. My name is Jose Rosala. Be sure to follow me, to like this, to share with your friends and see you soon.